another problem with the electric field state distribution is the case when you ter terminate the cable. Normally the electric field stress is distributed inside the insulation. But when you terminate the cable to connect it to terminals, you remove the cover, you remove the screen, you remove the insulation and connect the cable to the terminals. And in this place, high electric field stress occurs. Let me show you in quick field. This is the germ to model of the cable. Previously I used the plain parallel model class, now I will use the axisymmetric model class. So I have the X of rotation and I can see the cable cross section. So this block is the cable conductor. This is the insulation. And this is the cover. Again, in electric problem, we do not simulate the electric field distribution inside the conductors. Instead, on the conductor surfaces, we specify the electric potential of the conductors. So for this conductor, on its surface, I specify the electric potential of 100 to and 10 kilovolts. And the shield is grounded. Uh, to reduce the electric field stress in this place, Usually the stress control tube is used. So this block this block is stress control tube. Currently I labeled is, is as air. So, in fact, there is no stress control tube in this model. It's all the air. This block is air and this block is air. Now let's take a look at the simulation result. Here are the electric field lines, the potential lines, and I will switch on the electric field stress. From this value, you, you can see that the electric field stress is lower than the breakdown of the, insul of the cable main insulation. But at the same time, it is greater than the breakdown of the air outside the cable.
So here, the voltage test is about 17 kilovolts per millimeter, which is six times higher than the breakdown voltage of the air. To show you better, I will adjust the field picture. I will adjust the scale. This is the breakdown voltage for the air. Here is the conductor, conductor surface, insulation, shielding, and the cover. And in the place where the shielding is terminated, the electric field stress is very high. Now let's take a look what we can do with this trace control tube. A stress control tube is placed on the car cable termination. The tube is made of semiconducting materials, so it features some electric conductivity. And electric permittivity of the material depends on the electric field stress. So let's take a look at the simulation results with the stress control tube placed on the cable. Now I will place two simulation results close one to each other so you can compare the field pictures. I will adjust the field picture and I will adjust the scale. Now the left picture is the electric field stress distribution with stress control to you and the right picture is the electric field stress distribution with parts stress control tube. Let's take a look closer at the cable termination. Again, the red zone indicates the place where the electric field stress is above the 3 kilovolts per millimeter and which is the electric field breakdown voltage of the air. And you can see that this stress control tube, the electric field stress is reduced comparing to the case without stress control tube. And let's again adjust the field picture. 
and take a look at the air where the stress is above the breakdown voltage of the insulation. So again, I, I will adjust the scale. You can see nothing critical for the cable insulation in both cases. So the stress control tube allows to reduce the electric field stress in the air and at the same time it doesn't affect the electric field stress in the insulation. The electric field stress in the insulation stays on the low level.